All right, let's see here. Okay, so yeah, today we're gonna be installing some mods and then we're going to use those mods to make the game really easy and then just destroy a bunch of bosses. It's gonna be pretty cool. So if you're interested in knowing how to install ring or install mods onto Elden Ring, this is a good video to watch. And um, yeah, so let me just show you how to do that. First, you probably wanna back up your saves or save. And to get to that, you can go into Steam you can go to um, find your game in here, Elden Ring. Go to main image, browse local files, and it should pop up with a new window. And then this is where we're going to install some mods, I should say. But to get to the here saves, you'll go to uh, your C drive, then users, then your username. And then app data here. If you don't see this app data folder, you may need to come into these three little dots or view. It could be if you're on Windows 10. And then you'll click on options and go over to view. You'll turn on under this hidden files option. You'll turn on show hidden files, folders, and drives. And then also you'll want to un uncheck this hide extensions for known file types. That's not really related, but it is helpful to know what the file type extensions are. So come in here and then go to roaming and then go down and find Elden Ring. See this folder here, this has got your your save files themselves in here, these SL2 files. But just copy this whole folder and then put that someplace where you'll remember it. I'm just gonna put mine on my desktop. Let's put it right here. Actually, I'm gonna put a date in here too. So I'm gonna make a new folder, just put a date so I know when this was taken. As a matter of fact, yeah, you want to do this before you do any kind of modding, but, but yeah. Okay, there's my backup. And then go to back to um, the game or the mod page here. You're also going to want to install this. It's a uh, it's kind of like a mod manager in a way, but it's um, it's called Mod Engine 2, and you can get it from this GitHub page. You just type in Mod Engine 2 Elden Ring, and it should pop up in Google. I've got the link right here, so I'm just going to copy and paste it. And to install it, you need to find the ins, like the, yeah, the zip file. So I just clicked on this assets down here and it shows it right here. So I'm gonna download this file, not very big. I guess I'm just gonna download it to my Elden Ring. Oh, that's the thumbnails. Let's go up to desktop. Click on the Elden Ring mods folder here. Let's put this in here. And I'm gonna go, we'll come back to this. Just to my desktop, go to that folder I just saved to. And then we've got this here. So this is what we just downloaded, the zip file. To open zips, you're gonna need a tool called 7-Zip or another archive extractor. You can get 7-Zip from 7-zip.org. You just download and install that and you'll have this uh, this new option called, uh, well, show more options and I have this 7-Zip folder here. You could use the 7-Zip, which is good for all, like a bunch of different file types, RAR, dot rar files too windows does have like this built-in extractor which will work in this case so i'm just going to use this actually okay so here's mod engine you can actually just put this folder wherever you want i've got it in my elden ring mods folder on my desktop so you just run it from this uh this thing here and it should just find elden ring as far as I know, I'll have to test that out. Uh, let's just see here. Well, you may need to put it in your Elden Ring folder. Let's just let's just run this and see if it works. We may need to put this in our Elden Ring folder. I can't quite remember actually. Oh, we gotta we gotta read me here. Maybe we should read this. Uh, if you've installed mods with the original mod engine, it doesn't matter. 
Mod Engine 2 can also be extracted directly into your game directory if you wish, but this method is not recommended compared to using Launch Mod Elder. Yeah, so we don't want to put this in our game directory. Um, if you do this, you can double click the mod engine underscore to launch.exe to, la to directly to launch the game with the default configuration. You can also rename the launcher to start protected game. After backing up the existing one, you have Steam automatically launch with your mod. Yeah. Okay, but I'm not sure why I didn't launch it. You may get this. It's because it's a bat file, and usually hackers put stuff in, in bat files. So, this one, we can inspect it if you want to. See if we can figure out what it is doing, but. I hit edit, right? Edit. Oh, yeah. So, it's this is all it's doing. It's pretty simple. Um. I was just running the mod launcher with this configuration file. Then it launches Elden Ring. It's perfect. Does it all for you right there. Pretty snappy. Snappy and snazzy all at the same time. Okay, but so you'll want to make sure this puts your game in offline mode. And to see that, to make sure that happens, um, let's see, there should be some text. It should say offline someplace down here. Let's press button and make sure. Okay, yeah, so here's what you're seeing, or what you should see. Inappropriate activity detected, unable to start in online mode, which is what you want. Offline, so yeah, you'll be good to get into the game after this, do your, your mods or whatever, and that should prevent you from getting banned, which is highly Desirable. That's what you want to see. That's what you want to do. Unless you don't care, then I guess do whatever you want. Okay. So Mod Engine 2 is installed. Pretty easy for that one, honestly. I don't know where I went there. Okay, here we go. So let's install the Grand Merchant. This one's pretty cool. It puts it lets the that first merchant that you see, Merchant Kale. Let's him, uh, let's him be able to craft everything for free. Pretty, pretty sick. Okay, to install this, you go to files on this Nexus mod page. Make sure it's compatible with the, the game version that you're using. This one says this one can be used without needing mod engine to your UXM. We have that, so it should be okay. Let's see this one here. The standard gives you gestures too, so might as well. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. You don't want to install this with your mod manager. You want to do a manual download. It's just a habit for me. Okay, Grand Merchant. Let's put it in our mod folder that I have. And then we'll extract this one too. Just using the built-in Windows tool or 7-zip if you have it. Okay, so... Let's read this just to see. Yeah, don't want to play online with this mod active or you're going to definitely get banned. Strike the contents of this file into the mod folder in the same directory as mod engine launcher. So we'll take all of these. I wonder if we could just do this whole folder. I think we could do this whole folder here. And then go back over to our... Elden Ring. Well, actually, we need to go to. Yeah, this here. And then we need to go to our mod min mod engine folder. You get this mod folder here, and then you can paste this in there. <laughs> that should be it. 
I think this had a regulation bin file, yeah. So with these regulation bin files, you can only have one mod that changes this. So if you ever see a mod with, you know, regulation bin, just know that only one of those is going to load. So you may need to swap out what you want to play with. Let's try this out, see if it works. Make sure we get that offline mode. Perfect. Oh God, I gotta, can't play. If you play this game with controller, God help you. That is blasphemy. I'm trying to find my, where'd it go? Uh, Got another USB-C cable, I just gotta find it. I guess I'll just use this one. There we go, here's one. Don't worry, I found one. Oh God. Did not mean to press continue, that's okay though. Okay, let's, well we can just, we can just, Stay on this save, I guess. Let's go back to Big Papa Kale. Papa Kale. Right over here. See how chilly is. See if he's willing to sell us what we want, which is everything for free. It's me. Purchase. Yeah. Okay, so we may need to start a new save. And yeah, it doesn't have everything here. So let's start a new save. It could also be that um, we weren't supposed to put the folders. We may need, we may have needed to go one extra level down with those files, which I'll explain that in a second if this doesn't work. Go new game. Really don't want to get anything modern, I'm not save anyway, so it's, that's like my main save, so that would have sucked. Which class? Let's do the Vagabond. What's up? Guy, don't you? How do you? Oh, there's some favorites. Here we go. We got big baller. Here we go. We'll go with this fellow. Let's see some lad. Finish. All right, let's go in there. I kind of forgot there was an opening cinematic. I don't know why I forgot that. So I guess, yeah, we gotta do kill some people here. Or we can just run and jump off, I guess. Open these doors. This game does look pretty good. Can't deny that. Just magnificent. Oh, I can just jump off, right? I don't need to go fight that guy. I think I actually I think I need to get to the actual boss fight. I think this is just gonna take me right back. Rookie mistake, rookie mistake. Okay, here we go. Let's take off some of this stuff. There we go. Get in here, we'll um, skip past this guy, and then we'll go straight to the merchant. Merchant Kale. Big Baller Kale. Oh, 
Bye. Enjoy your fight. I had a good time with you. This song's kind of a banger. Need my little disco flute. This sounds like it could be a TikTok song. Is this a TikTok song? Like the cringy ones? Very well could be. If it is, it's kind of interesting because this is on the uh, epidemic sound. Someone could use the beat though. Look at that chin, dude. It's got chins for days, or chin for days. I don't know why I'm picking these items up. Habits, I guess. Gotta, gotta keep that light load. Don't want to be carrying around a big load, you know? Just this massive load to be carrying around, no fun. Alright, look at that nice hairy chest. Hey, buddy. Damn. Oh my gosh, all these... New tutorials, I need to turn that off. You can turn that off, can't you? Fairly certain you can. It'd be, hi it'd be highly unusual if you couldn't. Okay, here we go. Get one more grace, get this all set up. Oh, I've got a feeling it's probably still not gonna work. If it doesn't work, we're just gonna try a couple of things. Hey! Give me some of your goods, mother trucker. Okay, we're gonna have to go back. No problem. It's not a problem. Let's go to desktop. I think we. Ah, yeah, I hate this. It takes forever to get out of here. Okay, let's go back into the mod. I think. Maybe we take it out of here. Might be a level too deep. Hmm. We're not gonna need any of these text files. We're just gonna need these three, really. Let's paste those in there. Let's try it now. <clears throat> Let's see what it does. This song's kind of long. How long is this song? It's only like three minutes. Three schminutes. Launch, baby, launch. Go, 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 go. Oh my gosh. It's bugged. Oh, it's because I need the bat file. There we go. Silly me. Okay, so we're gonna get in here. We're just gonna go continue. We don't need to start a whole new game for this part. Um, since we already did one, we should be good. We're gonna get in there, we'll see if this merchant actually does what he's supposed to do now. Oh, here we go. This is what it's supposed to do. Okay, browse cut content. I've never seen this actually. It's kind of sick. Yeah, so if you put any of this stuff on there, you're most definitely gonna get banned if you try to go online with it. That's cool. Ragged loin cloth. Okay, so let's go to. Oh, we're still in the cut content. Okay, well, it doesn't. Oh, got gestures. Okay. Just browse regular stuff. Make sure everything is free. 
Yeah, so we still have item requirements. But we'll take care of that. Oh, trust me, we're gonna take care of that. Yeah, this is cool. Alright, so there's that. That is working correctly. Let's go install another one. I don't know why this game takes so long to close. I could close it faster if I just probably because it's trying to save your your stuff where you're at onto their servers. But yeah, I could close it faster by just going through my task manager. Okay. This is pretty cool. Now I think this should work. I think it's replacing items. I was thinking because it adds new items. I don't know if it'll show up in the, the fire merchant. It, it, possibly could this one's really cool easy mode definitely want this too no smithing stones smithing stones i guess that doesn't really matter with the merchant because you can just give us those so we might actually have to worry about that this one's cool too bosses and npcs as summons 186 added summons available to follow you and teleport let's get this just gonna read through here, make sure everything is cool. There's no surprises with like the installation. Backup save when we can watch the tutorial here. Download the mod, download mod engine, put mod inside it. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's just hope it doesn't change the bin file, but we won't know until we get in there, I guess. A thousand megabytes? Holy shit. Okay, well, maybe we should start to download on the other ones, too. This is kind of big. Save that. The other one that could be big is this. Yeah, let's get this downloaded. This game has RTX. I didn't even realize that. Ray tracing. Love it. Oh, my God. Download this. Uh, download this program to automatically download and install CUR, which is what you want. Then in the convergence ER, double click. Convergence. I think this guy makes it super easy. That's why it's got this extra one. But let's see. Maybe it's downloading the file from someplace else. I don't know. Oh, it's an EXE. Huh. You guys got it all figured out. Let's just do this. We know what we're doing. This one's huge. Holy moly. Got that downloaded. Easy mode. This one should be small. I don't know, man. I guess we gotta do easy mode because... Because we want to destroy these bosses. Quickly. Starting status, plus 10 of all. <laughs> One material. Ten times the rune. Two, two times player hit radius. Same as tweak number two. And... Let's do this one. Let's do his personal edit. Oh, but not with the mod manager. I keep doing that. It's a little bit different. You can use Vortex with this, but I don't, I don't know how that works with this mod engine, you know? It might be a little bit weird. We actually don't need this because we've got the Grand Merchant, so that should be okay. <laughs> Three minutes left, that's actually not too bad. Let's go look at our folder here. <clears throat> oh, we got some finished already. Move set mod pack. I don't know. This might be an old version. It looks like it actually is. That one we just did. 
So let's delete this. And this, since we don't need the zip file anymore. And this, just clean it up here while we wait for these to finish downloading. But let's go to this, extract it. See what it, we are working with here. Damn. Regulation bin. So some of these, yeah, like I said before, only one regulation bin can be loaded. Hopefully these other ones don't have that. There is some other methods you can do to get around that. I think you can merge some mods. Let's see. Uh, tired. Nine o'clock. It's getting late, guys. It's getting real late. Just looking over here, my that's my other screen. About where to find how to merge these mods. Tree Sentinel Thomas, my god, that sounds sick. Look at this. Look at this. That is terrifying. Thomas has got to be added into every moddable game. I think that's just a fact. A known fact. Like Thomas and Skyrim, that's that's the best. Pure nightmare fuel. Pure, that's a weird. Pure, pure. Pure. Okay. Randomizer mod. Let's see here. Let's just type it in. How to merge mods Elden Ring. How to merge regulation bin files. Yep, is no longer supported in the missing features that are vital for Elden Ring 1.07 feature updates. Merging should be used DS Map Studio, similar to Yapt, but has more features. I don't even know what DS Map Studio or Yapt was. I didn't even know. Merging right now, you should have your main Map Studio project open. Download the new mods regulation bin, create a new project. Param editor. Thanks to know, overall Elden Ring's mod merging is scuffed as hell. Bound to run into issues, nice. Try to merge overhauls or giant mod packs together, feel free to ask. Oh, you're, that's, you're gonna run into issues if you do that. Son of a gun. Where do we find these summons at? Also includes the legendary guts from Berserk. Summons. No, everything is added. It doesn't replace anything. Summons can be crafted. How the hell do you craft them? Anthony, what's up, dude? Hey, thanks. I appreciate it very much. Doing the uh, the mods work. Doing Todd's work, you know? Looking at some of these mods, we're just running it. I don't mod Elden Ring that much, but I uh, didn't realize how yeah, scuffed it is to merge some of these. Really, most of the mods, you can only play one at a time. Which is kind of lame. I want to play them all at the same time. But you can merge them. I guess you just could run into problems, especially when they're changing a lot of different things. But if we need to, we really don't need this grand merchant if we've got other powerful stuff. Or, 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 we get what we need from the grand merchant, then turn him off, and then put in one of these other mods. Huh? That's a big brain move right there. I know how to hack the system. This changes a lot of stuff. Okay, I just need to see where to find them. It says you could craft most of them, so I guess that's good. Yapped and Yabber, okay. Well, what do you think about the Wabajack mod list? Which which mod list? Just any Wabajack mod list? 
but learning disability so it makes it difficult for me to do modding because there's a lot of stuff so yeah for sure it's hard to pay attention to all of it uh mod lists are good i like i like wabajack there's also collections and vortex which is pretty similar i don't know which is easier um vortex collections are probably a little bit more mainstream but those have their own issues too I want to try to figure out how to use AI on my computer because they end up on my computer because they end up resetting my computer. Mods resetting your computer? Or is the AI taking over your computer? Is that what you're saying? You gotta watch out for that. One day, you never know. Alright, see how much this has got one minute left. I don't think that's going to take 30 minutes. Once this is done, it should speed up. I want to see what this move set kind of files it has in it. And then we'll, we'll, we'll test out one, another mod. Okay. It's almost here. It's almost here. Oh, it's right there. Okay, so this is a RAR file. So you'll need a 7 zip for this, which I had mentioned earlier, I believe. But yeah, you just go to 7 zip.org, download the tool, and then you're able to extract files like this. Anthony, I messed up my mod, so I had to reset my computer. That's not a very good. <laughs> That's all right, man. <laughs> Messed up the mods, you had to reset your computer. That is crazy. Really, it shouldn't do that much damage. Ultimately, all you'll really need to... Like, the, the most you should have to do is reinstall like your game. Or Vortex, possibly, but most likely just your game. But anything can be fixed. It's kind of hard to know what you did sometimes, though. Thinking about getting one of the Wabajack mod lists, which would set up Model Riser 2. You want me? I can show you. I can explain that a little bit better. You might run into it from time to time. But uh, so, like Windows can extract regular zip files with just this extract all button right there. But if it's these other type of these are called archive files, and they're like zipped up like this. Other type of archive files, like the RAR file. It's use a different tool. It doesn't come with Windows by default for for some unknown reason. Nice Bill Gates, I guess. Billiam Gates. Let me change this song real quick. There we go. Some nice chill coffee sounds. Okay, but then you'll want to go to this website called Seven Zip. I'll show you that. So 7-zip.org, you'll go on here, and then you will download, if you're on Windows, you'll, you'll download this one here. So you download that file, and then you just install it. It just downloads, and you can install it pretty easily. You just kind of hit next, 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 all through the, the things. And then you may need to restart your computer. It may ask you to if, you, if it does, and just restart it. But then you'll get this extra option when you right click on these files and Windows 10 it just shows up but on Windows 11 you just hit this show more options you get the 7-zip option here if you're on Windows 10 it'll just look like this then you hover over it you got all these options here but really you just need to hit extract files and then you just press OK and that'll extract like it did with that extract all button like this here so if you're running into that, that's kind of what you got to do. Okay, so I just extracted... What did I just do? Where is it? Okay, so there's that. Where's the folder? Am I just like... Did I not extract it before? Or am I blind? We didn't look at this either. That's a regulation file. Of course it is. Let's go to... Oh, no, I did that earlier. Regulation file. Everything's a regulation file. What the hell is up with that? That is lame. That is very lame. OK, 
Okay, Rar. So, well, I couldn't figure out which ones did the lead because it was all mixed in. Yeah, step by step instructions are good unless you're using Windows 11 while they're young. Yeah, no, it is kind of confusing. They are pretty similar for the most part. The only the the big difference that I've seen is just to show more options. That can get con confusing. No, you're good. Don't worry, man. I'll figure it out. I will not lose my place. I would have lost my train of thought anyways. It's throwing me off because, like, with these these type of files, you can only have one in Elden Ring. So it's like all these mods are editing that regulation bin file, so it's kind of kind of screwing me up. But if that's the case, let's look at this mod pack. Move set mod pack. This one's cool. Honestly, if we're going to destroy the bosses, though, we might just need the bosses and NPCs. We'll just let them do all the work. Let's go. Came from a movie in 1982. Let's go. This this music is that what you're talking about? <laughs> the soundtrack. Yeah, it's sick. Meme. What's up, Chance? I was out fishing. I just saw the coolest cloud. It was like a pirate pointing at the sunset. Dude, that is an elaborate cloud. Sounds sounds nice. If it wasn't exactly that, then I'm gonna be disappointed. Pirates in the sky. Clouds when they have those pictures are cool, but they, they're only there for a second, you know, and then they're gone. You gotta look at it just from the right angle. Oh. Said something earlier. You said, let's go, let's go. Made me think of that movie. Yeah, I'm just thinking it's funny. Let's go. Let's go. Well, we're almost finished with this convergence mod. Let's just test out. We got the Grand Merchant. I guess let's go in there. We'll get some cool stuff and then we can turn it off because we don't really need it. So let's get this baby cranked off. Crank it off. Can't see, can't see the details. Is, oh, yeah, with the clouds. Can't see the details is good, but you can still kind of see it. It's still out there. Holy moly. Dude, are you fishing right now? Did you catch any fish? Some big old whoppers. I've gone fishing like once in my life, and I did catch a fish that was a little crappie. Crappie fish. It just kind of freaks me out when you got to get the, the hooks out of their mouths. Yeah, I hate that. <laughs> just find it, it crank it off funny that came out in 1982 and it's being used so much on game. Is what movie you're talking about? Let's buy some stuff from this guy. I'm back, buddy. And I want all your shit. Not your literal shit, though. That would be bad. Okay, what... Uh, oh, these are daggers. Should we just get everything? Besides the shields? Because we don't need shields. That's so many things to get. Oh, my God. Let's get the big guns. Right, we want the big guns. Never seen this sword before. Sh Shriek of Milos causes blood loss. This is a... Uh, Huh. Let's get this. Um, Death's Poker Blasphemous Blade. No. Golden Order Greatsword. Dark Moon Greatsword. Let's get that. Uh, Grafted. That's pretty. Star Scourge. Let's get a couple of those. Malekith's Black Blade, of course. Magma Blade. Uh, Curved Greatsword, Beastman's Cleaver. Bloodhound Fang. Let's get that. Meme says, no, that was a photo I took earlier. The mosquitoes started swarming me. Yeah, those bloody, nasty mosquitoes. Imagine being on a boat and wrestling a tuna, bro. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's, it's way harder than any Elden Ring boss, that is certain. Those things are huge. It's weird that they're like, like tuna, like not in a can obviously, but like a tuna steak, it's like red. 
It's kind of crazy. Gargoyle's Black Blade. Twins. Let's get that. Just because. Guess we want the really big stuff though, because we want to we want to smash, right? I'm trying to smash Scarlet Rot Blade up. Sounds cool. Just trying to smash out here. Probably need a oh a cannon for sure, the jar cannon. But we'll probably need a staff of some sort. Gravity sorceries, get that. Scarlet, ah, uh, yeah, we'll figure it out. Shoot, man, we'll figure it out. If not, we'll just turn this back on. Ammunition, ah, whatever, we don't need that. It's gonna be too easy, we don't need any of that. Spells. Let's get the buffing spells. Or, man, really should have thought of a build, but it's too late now. Or this is searing spirits that repeatedly explode after delay. Let's just look for the buffs. There's so many things. Actually, that's not even there. Okay, where... Oh, there's a buff. Frost. Is there like a Scarlet Rot buff? That's probably a... Uh, item, huh? Blood Flame. Well, let's just toss that on there for good... Oh, Black Blade. Let's toss this on there for, for, for good measure. We don't need two of those, I guess, so... Ashes of War... Man, shit, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Beast Roar or Braggart's Roar. Uh... We'll come back to that. Oh, we gotta deck our character out. We gotta get Fly. Whoa, I don't think I've ever seen that one before. Okay, we gotta find the flyest fit on here. Ooh, kind of fly, kind of fly. There are so many helmets, I never realized how many helmets there were. Malketh's helm. We don't want to be too heavy either, so let's go for something a light armor. Lighter armor, I should say. That looks pretty slick. Oh, we got more armor though. Fia's robes, gold mask rags. Shaman furs. I guess this really doesn't matter because it's not like there's that many that let's get the grave cube actually let's get let's get this yeah let's get that oh damn it i keep doing i feel like there should be another category instead of just all in the same category but hey that's just me that's just me this will match our helmet every time i'm gonna do that every time i swear Pants, some baller pants, some shorts, let's rock some sh oh my god, I did it, I seriously didn't mean to do that this time. Oh, what is this? Cop those, let's put those on. Might be some other items we need from him, but let's let's check this armor out real quick. K. 
kind of slick. Kind of slick. Not gonna lie. Let's look at these small clothes. Wow. Salacious. That was probably a little too risky. But let's keep it on. I think it looks. I think this looks nice. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Got the cannon. 34 strength. I wield that bad boy. My heavens. Okay. So we've got... Let's see if there's anything else. I don't think there's anything else that we'll need, but let's just check. Ashes of War Talismans. Armor. Items. Gesture. Oh, spirit summons. Okay. We're done. Let's add some of the new spirit summons. But I'm trying to think. It says we can craft them, so that should be okay. Let's, let's get out of here. Let's turn this mod off. We'll get the other one going. Grand Merchant, we got that one. The other mod should be finished by now. So let's go back over here. Um, <laughs> okay, here we go. Look at the move set. We want bosses. All right, let's see how this how this goes. I think we need all of this here. Copy. Go back to. Guess we didn't go that far back. We go over here. Place the files. Let's just delete these. Okay. Launch the game. Get in here, we'll see, see what it do. Hopefully the game doesn't crash. I don't think it should, I think it should be all right. Continue. Check it out. Check her out. Cool, we still got our stuff, which is good. We are hacking the system for sure. So he shouldn't be able to give us everything now. Yeah, yeah, back to normal. Okay, can I get a craft crafters? Oh man, when do I get item crafting? Do I have to purchase that from him? Crafting kit. Okay, let's go get 300 souls. Is this gonna do any damage with this? Let's put this back on. Really nice to have a horse. So let's. This isn't Ronnie. Or no, what's her name? Gives us the horse. Let's run down here. We'll get a horse and then. Um... Yeah. We'll be set. Kill some fellows on the way. 60. Kill all these guys. Kukri. Kukri. What are we at? 120? Okay, just a few more. run up here so we can get the horse and then we'll come back we can travel a little bit faster always gotta have that horse you know always gotta get that horse just 
just love the way this game looks. Looks pretty fantastical. If you guys like that... That deathbed piece I got on. Pretty slick. Here we go. Give me the horse! Accept. Bequeath me. There we go. Okay, let's throw this on our our persons. Oh my gosh. Okay, I get it. Alright. I think we have not enough souls yet. We'll just smack these peasants around like the dirty nobodies that they are. Okay, we got 300 now. Let's go get the crafter. Whoa, I didn't know these, these bats always come down here like that. Never seen them come down there. It's kind of weird. Is that an update? Smack them. Smack them around. I just love how, like, there's so much flowiness in this game with the cloaks and stuff. Kinda sick. Kinda sick. Purchase! Give me this. Bye, Kale. Okay, I gotta turn off these tutorials. That's too much, honestly. Where do you turn them off at? Off, thank you. Oh, damn it. Item crafting. Okay, we should be able to craft these summons. This okay, look, there's some stuff in here to craft. Here we go. This is what I was talking about. Okay, Ronnie summon. Summons Ronnie. Oh, damn. Summon them all. Yeah, I'll craft that. Molina's sword. Oh, the beasts? They just summon them? Okay, so these are all summons. Can summon him? That's sick. Summon Godric? Let's go ahead and get that. Melania. Get that guy. I just want to see everyone who you can summon. You can summon a whole gang of people, which is kind of sick. I like that. The Legendary Five, hell yeah. And Clean Crow Finlay. Alright. Summon them both, same people. Okay, I think we've. How many? There's quite a few of these, I believe. I'm gonna get the one. The legendary bundle. So I'm looking for ones that have multiple people in them. Ooh. Sisters of Aeonia. I don't think those are very powerful. We want some. We want the real. The real powerhouse. All demigods? Okay, let's get that. That sounds sick. Okay, Molag. Oh, who's this? The Clean Rot Triad. The Red Main Knights. Exiled Legion. Oh, soldiers. So it's just like dragons. The bug down here or what? Fia. Is this just their clothes? Or is it bugged on me? Wolf Reavers? I'm confused as to what this does. Let's just get this. Whoa. Huh. <laughs> 
That doesn't look good. Cues as to what that does. Looks a little weird. I don't know if that's right. I don't know if that's right, guys. Let's stay away from that. Okay, do I have the ability to summon? What do I need to use to summon again? Alright, let's see if I can just do this here. Just summon him anywhere. Okay, now I gotta be in the boss fight, which is fine. We can get there. Alright, I'm gonna have to go for just a second, but I'm gonna be right back. Um, once I get back, we will obviously use that to tear up some people. So, I'll be right back. Probably like a couple minutes. Well, maybe not. But I've just been kidding, I guess. Just watching my dog. Might have to go in just a second, but we'll see. We'll just see what happens. Okay, let's go into a boss fight. Oh. Uh... Man, the quickest way to get to... What's his name? It's kind of hard. I wonder... These summons probably won't work. So, okay. We're, we're going to hack the system a little bit here. We're going to... We're going to be flipping between these... Um, bin files. So, we've got that. That should be good. But then we're going to turn on easy mode. So, nothing kills us. Because that's what we do. We're hacking the system here. And to do that, we need this personal edit. Let's take this. We'll just, I don't know if we need that other CSV file, but we'll just pretend we do. I'll just put this in here for, we'll say, uh, temp. throw all these into this temp folder so we can just pull it out pretty easy while we're waiting while we're using this other one we'll just pop these into the main mod thing here and that should run and the other one shouldn't because it won't know what the hell it's looking at okay now this is the mod that makes everything really easy so this is easy mode get there so we can get to uh Godric, I guess, and then we'll turn it off. We'll pull out our summons and we'll let them do all the work for us. Because why not? I don't need to work that hard. Everyone complaining about how uh, this game's too hard. Not anymore. This is the real way to play. This is how real gamers play. Okay, well, let's test to make sure this is on, I guess. Do, do we keep our summons, too? No, it doesn't look like we did. I'm trying to see, did is that decrease damage at all? Shoot, I don't know. Hopefully it's working, but we're going to find out. Hmm. 
Like how I did that. Okay, let's get this going here. Let me make sure this is working. Or see if I can figure out what all it's supposed to change here. Easy mode. Okay, we've got the personal edit. Reduce 50%, increase 25, 10 times rune, 2 times player hit radius, crimson, cerulean tears heal, increase FP cost, increase weapon scaling, starting status at plus 10 all, item discovery is always 500, all these are healed. I think it should be okay. I think it'll work. <laughs> so it's not uh, foolproof, but it's gonna help quite a bit for an idiot like myself. For a noob idiot like myself. Let's go. Just cranking on through here. Picking up these seeds. Getting to Godric. Gonna get this grace just in case. Just in case things don't go my way. I think I'm gonna need a shield for this if I if I know anything. I watched uh some modders do this. What is this? What is she gonna tell me here? Watch the modders get it to Godric, or not modders, just speedrunners. And uh, it looks a little difficult. Not gonna lie. There's a very specific path you need to take, but let's just hope this mod doesn't negate us from having to do that. You know? Let me move this to my sp my special. Inventory. How do you put this onto your special thing here? A talisman. Oh, shit, I got a talisman. What the hell was I thinking? I didn't even grab it. How do I... Oh, there we go. Figure it out. Don't worry, guys. I don't need you anyways. Put it in my pouch. Put my horse in my pouch. Run past these guys. We got... I've got a thing to do here. Holy shit. Well, I think this if this was uh, not modded. I think I definitely would have died there, so. That's something, right? Get out of that. Yeah, there you go, little heathen. Is this where Godric's at? Is he right up there? It's gotta be, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, so, yeah. We're right on the bus. So we're gonna rest here, then we're gonna switch off, then we can get our cool summons. I was thinking of, um, or this is, whatever, not Godric, but the other guy who comes first. Whatever his name is. The horn guy. NPCs custom sum. Oh, wait, we already got this in our folder, so we just need to pull it out. Make another temp folder. I guess we'll call this uh, easy mode. Just in case we need to pull this back out. Paste those in there. Take all this stuff. Put it back out here. 
I'm just doing this so I can s swap between the mods. Since you can only use all these mods, you can only use one at a time, which is kind of lame. But uh, that's what we got to do. You can only use them one at a time, but you still see the effects from having multiple, if that makes any sense. Because of uh, like the items, some of them, once you have them, you have them, so it works out. It works out sometimes. Now we're getting here, we're going to get the, the elite squad of summons. We're going to summon them, and it should just destroy this guy. That's what I'm hoping for, anyways. That is what I am crossing my fingers for. I think we need to craft the stuff. Oh, yeah. I want the one with all of them. The elite squad. The legendary five. Look at that. There's also another one that I think would be good. It was like the demigods. Had quite a few people in it. it had like eight people. <laughs> I don't think that would uh, be absolutely cracked. And I think we should start with that. The eight demigods. This is the one. So let's put this on our items. We might actually... Because can't you summon multiple times? So we might need to put most of our juice into MP. Let's try that. Let's do the... Did I get the right one? I want to make sure I got the, the demigods. It said something weird on there, so I don't I can tell for for certain. So let's double check the eight demigods. Oh, here we go. Huh? Didn't remember getting that one. Here we go. Eight demigods. Okay, here we go, guys. Let's get it. This guy's about to be wrecked. Oh, I don't have the thing yet. Well, go ahead and kill me. Uh, where do you get, how do you summon? Isn't that from, you get that from Ronnie, don't you? The summoning bell. Need my little summoning bell. When do you get that? It's been so long since I've got that. Let's look and see how we get the summoning bell. Summon bell, Elden Ring. Spirit calling bell. I gotta go speak to Ronnie real quick. Sh shame on me for forgetting. She should be in the church. And then we can come right back. Get the summoning bell. Hey! Oh, Rena. I was thinking Ronnie, whatever the hell. I can do it. I can do it. Thank you. Yeah, I need this. I've got some business to take care of. Hope you don't mind, but I'm going to be summoning your, um, your family. Actually, I think I might be summoning her, too. She's a demigod, right? Can I just summon these guys anywhere? Certainly looks like it. This is sick. 
Oh my god. Alright guys. Uh can I squeeze can I squeeze through here? Excuse me. Yep, just follow me in here. <clears throat> yeah, come in here with me. Hey, um, Margaret, I'm back. Oh my god, they can't come through the, the gate? Let me s Shh. Oh, they're back. Oh, damn it. Oh, here we go. They're teleporting in. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. A bit of a bloodbath. I don't think it counts. I think we died too soon. But. <laughs> oh my god. This is the mod to have for sure. Little crack there. We just gotta get inside the uh, fog gate. The fog wall. Let's summon our friends again. Come on, boys. Help me out here. Margaret's being a real... Real teaser. Thank you so much, guys. You've really just been a joy. Should we continue on, fellas? Should we keep on going? Let me, let me touch Grace here. Touch Grace. Let me level up so I don't lose these things. My ruins. Oh, hey. It's okay. That's <laughs> so much fun. <laughs> okay, get over this. No. Level up. Do, uh, probably don't need vigor, honestly. We just need some strength. Let's do dexterity. Oh, shoot, yeah, we're gonna have to go that high to get wield some weapons anyway, so that's good. Let's see what weapons we can get, and then we're gonna whip out 30 decks. I need 18 strength for that. Dragon Slide, I don't think I picked that up. Dark Moon Sword. Colossal Sword, I need strength for these. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Okay. Let's continue on. Let's summon the legendary five next here. Actually, to get to get to our people, let's let's use our crew again. Our friends. Come on, boys. Oh, did I have Margaret killing Margaret? It's kinda kinda a little twisted. But come on, boys. Let's go up through here. I've got some people I need you to take care of for me. So just disappeared after I touch a grace. Okay, whatever. Let's get this gate open, then we'll summon him one more time. You there? Come over here. Open the gate, buddy. I've got business to take care of. No, I'll use the main gate. Nah, dude, doesn't he like to take money from you if you don't? Open the gate. Open the gate. Open her up. Got me and my gangster crew here. Boys, come on with me. Come along. Um, let me squeeze through here. Thank you. Oh God. Oh, damn it. Jeez, guys, get in there and take care of business, fellas. I know you're massive, but, um... Show a little initiative, you know? Let's go s smaller crew. The Legendary Five. There we go. These boys should be able to d d d do some work for me. I think you come up this way. Please tell me, Mike. 
as you can see, they're doing a little bit of work here. See, I knew this was going to be tricky because this parts were just difficult to get through. There's a special way you can go that I see speedrunners do all the time. I just don't know what the hell direction it is. That's okay, though. We're going to do this. We can do this. We can do this. Let the bros come on in here. They should be taking care of business for us right about now. I'm just, I'm just so, look, they're guarding me right now. How cool is that? How chill are these guys? What the hell is that? All right, come on, boys. You know what to do. <laughs> oh God! Hey, Malaketh, or uh, whatever your name is, Black Bait, Black Blade guy. Hey. Quit being sneaky. We've got problems. We've got bigger problems over here. Do I need to bring out the big guns? Just dodge, dodge, dodge. <laughs> There we go. We're gonna take care of business for us. Who knew you could take down trees? Malaketh is pissed. Renalia doing her thing. Obviously not very well, everyone knows that. Dude, Millennia is mm, a little cracked. Look at the health pool down there on the, on the left. Kind of insane. Only one little tick gone by. Okay, guys, I guess. Is it up here? Is this where we go? Okay, let's get. Um, let's send these guys back. I don't think they're going to fit through the gate, unfortunately. But then we can, let's summon these. We can craft more too. Oh God, did my game just crash? Shit. I think it should have, uh, oh, oh yeah, crash. Okay, they should have saved though, because this game saves pretty frequently. This is not a big deal. Like in Skyrim it would be a big deal, because you know, it only saves whenever you save, but this should be better. I think there's a dragon. Let's get the, the, the magma worm, too. Worm. I think that would be sick. At the end of the previous session, quick game, a return to something might not have been selected. I didn't, I didn't mean to. Didn't mean to make you angry. Miyazaki. Okay. Not good. Let's get the demigods back out. Why didn't... Why wasn't everyone dead? It's kind of a shame. Okay, let them kill everyone here. Hey! We got a... We got a guy... Take care of him, fellas. While I get this mushroom. I wanted to kill that because I didn't... Okay, so it's like that didn't even count. It's kind of weird. Well, which attack is that? Who does that attack? Okay, can you boys, let's send the boys back. Send them away for now. 
And then we will summon... Let's see if this crashes the game again. Shit, okay, so that one crashes the game. Don't, don't run that one. We know for facts. I'm just gonna get rid of that item. Because it ain't gonna work. Hmm. Well, I'm glad the demigod one works. That one's sick, honestly. I'm gonna clear this area out because I can't be bothered. Thank you, thank you. Who is she trying to hit? Just shooting through that guy. Yeah, so I think their bodies are too big to fit through here. So let's send them back from whence they came. Let's craft some new fellas. Get the magma worm here because it sounds sick. Knights of the Great Jar. It also sounds kind of sick. Let's, uh, how many of those can we summon? Okay, we don't want that one. That one does not play well. Okay, let's do this. That was a close one. Oh, I, I thought they'd be jars. Who the hell is Knights of the Jar? You guys can be able to do what I need you to do, or do I need to summon a dragon? Goodbye. Magma Worm, is he coming, or what's going on here? My god! Hey, I've got a friend too, he's just not here yet. Get up there, guys. Got you through the gate. Take care of business for me. If you wouldn't mind. It's hard to see what's going on, this is insane. Okay, hey guys, thank you for killing them. Just, just, oh, just smash them for me. Being very grateful. Thank you very much. Yep, just run them on through. I'm gonna walk up here so you guys can get a better angle. Where am I getting shot? Oh my god, of course. I saw that coming. They can't reach those guys, even with the, you know, hacks here. Trying to climb up on there. A little insane. What? Okay, so it puts us way back here. Where am I? Okay, let's just run th Oh my god, okay. Hang on, let's get in here. Motherfuckers. I mean, I know I shouldn't have done that. Okay, let's get up here. I just need to quit out of the game when I get there. I think that should save my spot, honestly. Summon the bros. So they can do their carnage. They're taking care of business. Renali is one-shotting people from across the map. This guy is not concerned about me. He's obviously got... Eight Demi Bros up there really... Really doing work to his friends, so... Okay, alright. So there's that. Send them back to the beyond. 
Get out of here. Scram. Okay, I'm gonna get the demigods in here. Because they can't fit to the gate. So I'm just gonna kind of let them do their thing up there. And hope that they can get all of this, the shooters. All my shooters. That guy up there is gonna be a bit of a problem. Maybe not. Radon might have him. The Radons might have it. Oh my gosh, still kinda shooting from afar though. Get up there. Just use them as my shield, I guess. Just kind of hide in the corner while my, my friends help me out here. I just hope that it's all going well for them. Is it is it safe to come out now, fellas? Not yet, I guess, huh? You're really doing work on them, though. I'm very proud of you. All right, guys. Can you fit through here? No, they can't. Okay, we need to send them back. It's going to be a little difficult to get them to come back, though, once they get in here. Because they can't freaking fit through the door. And this guy's going to shoot me as soon as I summon. Psych! Now you have messed up. You have failed. Alright guys, just clear this courtyard out for me real quick. Honestly, that horn's not going to do you any good, buddy. We've got literally the Elden King here. Elden Lord Numero Uno. And all of his peeps. The pike! Exile gauntlets. This is sick. Hey. Here comes Malekith. And Melania. I feel really bad, you know? I just feel so bad for you. And the guy's kinda got a lot of health. Oh god, there's a, is there a giant? Isn't there a giant someplace around here, though? Those are all my bros. Stomping around. Okay, which way to the boss fight? Once we get into the boss fight... Uh, I'm gonna use a different... Different group of friends. I really wanna try out the magma worm. I want to sit here because I don't want to accidentally die. Who are you guys shooting at? Who do you guys see? Oh no, the bot is it up here? Is this where the, the fight is at? Meliketh, get him. Sick him. Meliketh, sick. There we go. 
Just gonna have these guys kind of run through them a little bit. Just knock these out of my path. I just honestly, I can't be bothered with it, you know? It's kind of not my thing. Okay, here's the, here's the boss fight up here. Guys, clear a path for me, please. We're done, buddy. He's over here. I know. You got enemies up behind the wall. You want to get... It hurts. I know, I know. But we got, we got a big giant guy right here, fellas. Big giant right here. Renalia. Yep, big giant still right here. There we go. There you go. Good work, fellas. Lady fellas. A lot of mushrooms over here. A lot of shrooms. Okay, here's the boss fight. Let's, let me get in here, sit down at this bonfire. Grace, side of grace, I guess is what they're called here. So we, if the game crashes, at least we'll be right here. Okay. And I'm gonna change my flask. I thought I would need flask for the uh, the bell, but I, I don't know, I guess I was just confused. You don't need those actually. You don't even need it. Okay, flash charges. Let's just keep it like that. Okay, I want to try this magma worm out. So let's go back out here, summon this guy, see if he comes out or not. I think he might be a little bugged, unfortunately. But let's find some other people to summon. Let's find someone fun. Crucible Knight, Father and Daughter. Um, if you see someone, let me know that you want. Knight, I got that one. That wasn't that cool. Necromancer Garrus. Finlay, the Legendary Five. I think that one bugged out too, unfortunately. Malekith and Garonk. Ronnie the Witch. Blood, Blade. Blade, I guess his name is. Berserker, let's get this. Sorcerers. That is the Berserker one. That's kind of sick, actually. Okay. Patches. No, oh, fuck patches. Sisters of Aeonia. I think I tried that one. It might crash. Let's try it. Let's just get it. Let's just get it. Let's see what happens. Let me solo her. Let's get him. The eight demigods was a lot of fun, actually. Family of Rot. Ascended Family of Rot. Yeah, we want the Ascended one, actually. The Eight Banished Knights. Banished Legion. That sounds fun. The Red Main Knights. Uh, how many? I just want a gang, you know? I want a, I want a whole crew. So this one wasn't working. The jars, they're alright, but nothing special. Banish the Legion. Throw that on there. Ascended Family. Of course, that. That is a surprise. 
Okay, let's pull out Let Me Solo Her here. Pull out the kid. I take care of business, man. Do work, man. Show us your moves, guy. Oh, yeah, that's some damage. My heavens. Okay. Let's save again. Hopefully, this saves it by sitting at this thing. And what do you guys think? Should we go on... Should we bring on the, the Legion? The Ascended Family of Rot? Or my Special Surprise? Let's do my Special Surprise. This is, oh, I thought this was the Berserker version. Not very Berserker-like. Or Berserk, I guess. I thought it would be like Guts from Berserk. That's okay. I thought it said it had that, though. Let's let's look at that. I want to see. Just run through it. Just run in through it. Let's flip. Okay, we're looking for Berserk anywhere where it says that. I'm just going to use my highly trained professional eyeballs to spot that. how fast I can go. Oh my god, my eyes, my eyes, my eyes. Blade, blight. Okay, so that's just a normal one. Star Scourge. There's blight again. That says Berserker. It just wasn't very Berserker-like, you know? Oh, a dragon? Fuck yeah. I didn't even see this before. Summons Dragon Lord plus City Axe. Lich Dragon, Fortis Axe, Ancient Dragon, Land the... Lena Snacks. Okay, again, let's look for Berserker. Berserk. Patches. Now, there are a few down here that I can't see because it's like glitched out. A fall. <laughs> Didn't even notice this. Okay, let's take two. Blackguard. Okay, I think we've got our crew. I don't see. Oh, so oh, here we go. Found it. Perfect. Found what we were looking for. Get that on there. We just want options, you know? Gotta run deep with my crew. Okay, let's take them off because we've kind of used them too many times, so let's do something else. Okay. Save again, and then we're gonna go fight Godric. Should I whip out the dragon or should I go with guts? Let's whip out the dragon. Skip this, we've already seen that. My god, that's a large dragon. He's got two heads. Uh, He's much larger. What are you trying to kill? He's right over there. This might be kind of a fair fight. <laughs> Is he stunned? Did Godric stun him? I don't know, guys. Oh. Getting whipped over here. He can't hit him. He's so big, he can't even hit him. Did 
Dude, Godric actually might be a little cracked. Wait till he gets his special dragon head. Oh, he can teleport? I did not know that. He's missing a head. That's kind of cool. I have not seen this boss. I don't... Where does this boss even show up at? That's kind of sick. That is a cool design. I'm lagging like crazy, though. Oh, no. Attack the dragon! Oh, okay. Well, the uh, Dragon Lord plus City of Sacks kind of sucks. He's nothing compared to my crew. My demigod crew. Those are the real bros. Okay, so let's take him off the list because obviously he's not not cool. Let's go with the Legion. The Banished Legion. I think we gotta get in here first though, or else they won't show up. Okay, boys. Just my whole swarm of enemies. That's kinda cool. I like how many there are. Let's see what happens here. Just go and clear out the joint. Okay, I don't want him to kill him yet. Let Godric do his thing. Send them back! Send them back! Give me guts! There we go. Oh god. This can't be good. I don't know why. <laughs> this is happening. Seizure warning, be careful. Guts, uh... Summons a whole... Underworld itself, oh my god. I don't know if this is just bugged or if, uh, this is intentional. Do you want to see what he looks like, though? I think it's trying to load an effect or something that's just not there. It's cool. Goodbye. You're trying to hurt. Probably won't even go away. Oh, okay, good. That was insane. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Where else can we go to, like, obliterate people? Let's go. Hmm. That's all we got there. Let's go to. I guess let's go back into this the castle. I want to pull out one more person. Oh, let's see what this looks like. We already seen her, so it's just five of them. Oh, all the sisters or whatever. The whole crew. It's kind of cool. Then what else? Let's Lich Dragon Fortis Snacks. Big boy. Take him out in the field. The dragons, I think it. I think their hitboxes are just too large. Send him away. Banish Legion Legendary 5. I guess there's that. We did let me solo her, so let's do... This full-grown Falling Star Beast. I think it's freaky. I thought this was the Elden Beast, actually. I'm surprised that's not an option. Just my little pet. Just my little pet. Okay, I'm gonna see if the the, the falling or the uh, the Elden Beast is in here. I'll holler out if you guys see it. Elden Beast. 
Elden Ring or Elden Beast, Elden Lord, first Elden Lord. <laughs> Summons a Radagon and Elden Beast. Okay, that's kind of correct. Where is Elden Beast? It's got to be just the Elden Beast if there's a combo in there. Oh, there it is. Let's get rid of the dragons. Oh, let's try and summon the legendary five. Did I try that? I don't know if I tried that before. Get rid of the falling star beast. Let's try the legendary five here. Oh, we did this earlier. Yeah, these bros are cool. These guys work out pretty well. Definitely legendary. We're gonna have to get rid of guts because that's just like bugged as hell. Um, where did I? Okay, I didn't put it on here. I guess. Am I missing it? Oh, there it is, Elden Beast. Here we go. Damn, that's pretty big too. <laughs> All right. Very nice. Okay, let's get this set up because I want to get this perfect. Banish Legion is is good. Legendary Five is good. Elden Beast that needs to be a little higher up. Let's put the Banish Legion right here. I'm getting this set up for the next stream. I'm getting ready to get off actually. Let's get these set up how we want them. Just, just crank it up slowly. Do a single character here. Mm, Blade would be good. Blade, however the hell you say his name. A group. Hmm. Probably a little too extreme for that there. Yeah, let's just put the falling star beast right there. Let's craft a couple more. Crucible duo. Beast clergyman. Who would be another good one? You look a big guy. A big old feller or a couple of people. Spirit of the first Elden Lord, Horlu and Godfrey, Axe Restored, first Lord, first Elden Lord. Radagon and the Elden Beast. Malakath and the Beast Clergyman. Dragon Maiden Millennia. Who's what the hell's that? Deathbringer Millennia? Let's just look at that. Let's save the Elden Beast for the last. The Elite Eight. The Crew, the Eight Timmy Gods. Okay, I think that's probably good there. The legendary five would be good there. So we got one more place. We need like another single person, probably kind of big. Basically, exactly what we were already looking for. Star Scourge Radon. Godric the Gat grafted. Elmer of the Briar, Fire Giant, Commander, no, I guess sucks. Summons Red Wolf of Radagon, 
No dragons. Deathright bird. It'd be kind of hard to kill. Baleful shadow. That's just a regular normal person. Awakened fire giant. Rykard? That's not a bad option, actually. The god devouring serpent, anyways. Hmm. A rune bear? Actually, let's do the rune bear. Those things are insane. I think that's the right. I think that's the right way to go. What's up, Padafo? What's going on, dude? Looking at these summons that we can do. It's kind of sick, actually. It's a cool one. Kind of sick. I got this Elden Beast here. But I'm going to just kind of check out each one of these. I want to see what Deathbringer Millennia is, first of all. Ah! God! Please don't crash! God! Dang it! That sucks. Ah! Uh, because it didn't save. That's why it sucks. Hey guys, that would have been pretty cool. I think that's where I'm going to stop it. Um, pretty neat. All those mods. This one's really cool, actually. If you want easy mode, don't even worry about any of these other mods. Just get bosses and NPCs. Just summon whoever you want, and they will just take care of everyone for you. You just walk through people. It's kind of awesome. If you want like a realistic one, I think Convergence is a good mod. Adds a, a lot of different stuff you can do. This is cool too, like new movesets and stuff. That's always fun. Those are for more casual play. Grand Merchant's fun if you don't want to ruin your thing too much. But uh, bosses and NPCs, definitely uh, broken. So, yeah, if you want to do that, highly recommend. But Afro, thanks for stopping by, dude. I'm going to head to bed, I think. Thanks for hanging out, guys, and I will talk to you. Um, Probably stream again on Sunday. What is today? Thursday? Saturday or Sunday? I haven't decided yet. But, yeah.